So we're out on another early morning adventure. It's been a while since we've gone out on one of these. Really hard to do in the winter with uh, the time change here, making sunrise super early. It's about 5.30 now. Not too sure how much further I have to go, but I think we're about an hour out from sunrise right now. Um, this trip for me is really more about getting out and taking some photos and kind of getting back into photography a little bit. This has uh, been a hobby that I've been in uh, since 2010 now. So something that I've just always kind of liked and I'm looking forward to getting out and hopefully getting some good photos today. I think the uh, lighting should be pretty decent. It's supposed to be partly cloudy. It's pretty cold out right now um but yeah it's been a while since we've been out on one of these adventures and i'm looking forward to getting out here It is an absolutely gorgeous morning today. It is frigid cold out right now. It's gotta be low 20s, maybe even teens out here. So super cold, but the sunrise is absolutely amazing. I had to stop, take some pictures, but I think I'm gonna get back in the warm truck now and we're gonna head further out this way and uh, find some more photo opportunities and ultimately get to our destination, which is this big crack in the ground. And that's actually what it's called. So yeah, looking forward to that. I am pumped with uh, how everything's looking this morning. It's absolutely awesome. So I just pulled up and there's nobody else here. It's just me. I'm going to pack up my backpack and grab some of my camera stuff. And I think we're gonna go ahead and hike into the, the crack and check it out. I don't really know what to expect. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Well, it looks like we found it. Um, it goes in both directions. So this looks a little bit more wide open. I can see it goes um, over there a bit further, but this direction over here looks a bit cooler. It's pretty narrow and looks like it gets deep and a little bit dark. So I think we're gonna head off in that direction and check this out. This is pretty cool. So I just got to the bottom of this little section here. This is super, super rad down here. It's like 
probably a good 15 degrees colder down here and it's definitely treacherous. There's uh, a bunch of ice on the bottom of this here. Yeah, so pretty, pretty slippery, but man, it is just so cool down here. I'm loving it. Man, this is just so cool. You round every corner and there's just something even cooler hiding around the bend. Like this, this section is rad. Oh, it looks a little tight in here, huh? Oh, I can't fit through there. I ain't gonna crawl for that. Looks like there's another way out. That's, uh, back we go. All right, let's try this way. This is tight too. Oh, shit. And slick. Oh. Oh. That sun feels good. So I'm back up here at the top. Gonna have a snack. I went and explored down that the crack um, quite a ways until it got to some big rock outcroppings and some drops. Little difficult to navigate with the camera and the ice on the ground. Um, I think this is like two or three miles long in its entirety, so it's pretty big. But it's just I don't know. It's so cool how uh, how many hidden gems there are out here in the high desert. And I mean, this really isn't even a hidden gem, but. I don't know, there's just so many cool features out and around this area. I really love the kind of the volcanic nature of just this part of the state. It's really unique and there's a lot of cool stuff to find. But I'm gonna have a snack right now and then I think I'm gonna hike back to the truck and we're probably gonna find somewhere else to explore around here. Man, it's turning out to be a really nice day out here today. Sun's out and feels really good. This is awesome. All right, so I think I'm gonna take a look at Gaia Maps now and just see what is around here to check out. So I'm heading down the road now. There's actually a campground out here that the guy at the gas station told me to check out when I was uh, filling up this morning. Ooh, this road is so washboardy, but it's not too far away, so I'm gonna go check it out. It's pretty far out here, so I couldn't imagine it being super busy, uh, but he said there was a good view up there, so we're gonna go check it out. Man, this is a good view. You can see the dunes way out there in the distance. It's pretty windy up here. That wind's got some bite to it. This is a pretty rad little uh, campground. Um, the spaces are pretty decent and this one uh, right behind me here has got some pretty good views. Man, it's been a pretty good day so far. I'm 
pleasantly surprised just kind of with this area and all that's in here. It's really pretty. Um, there's a lot of cool features out here. Uh, I love just taking these kind of early morning adventures, getting up before the sun rises, getting photos and just kind of watching all the colors as the sun comes up and exploring new areas. This is kind of a big piece of the process for me and how I find, you know, cool places to camp um, and, you know, cool places to explore is just really taking the time, you know, take a day here and there to get out and just scout a new area, look for cool sites and things like that. And then I get to, you know, mark all these places on my map um, as like a collection, you know, of places that I can return to in the future if I want to spend more time. Makes getting out on like, uh, you know, just a regular weekend in between work days that much easier because you already have, you know, a bunch of places that you know are good. Um, so you can really just pick a spot and go out to it. But yeah, it's nice. I, I've never been really in this area. So a couple new places kind of added to, to my collection. So I'm pretty happy. There's this butte out here um, that looks pretty cool. I am going to put up the FPV drone and fly around it. And I think this will probably be the last stop uh, we make on this adventure this morning. Man, that was a blast. It's always a fun time getting that drone up and just soaring through the trees like that. It's uh, definitely an adrenaline rush. But I think that really wraps up this video. It was a great day today of exploring and uh, getting out into some new areas that I've never been before. I just love doing that. Hopefully you guys enjoyed coming along for the ride. Uh, give this video a like, it definitely helps me, um, kind of helps get my channel out there. And uh, subscribe if you haven't, there's going to be a lot more videos to come. But until then, I'll catch you guys in the next video.